Kara, can it be so that we met this winter five years ago? It seems like just yesterday you lived in HC when life was all about hiking, brewery beers, and having a DP. Thank God you met my gal from Essex Fells, and she convinced you to move away from those city smells. Five years of adventures brings lots of memories. The ones that stand out are some of these. 2010 was our first winter where the beer flows like wine, and still acting like we were in college was just fine. College turned into Colorado. It was easy for us to get into that Western flow. Skiing almost every day made life pretty darn good. <laughs> you working at the Hyatt, all those cute bellmen, meeting all those cute bellmen, as you should. <laughs> yes, those were my sharpshooter days. How can we forget? We did learn some great poses. And more importantly, our hot friend, Brett. <laughs> our first Highland cl Highlands closing with Afro rig Afro wigs, bandanas was one for the books. We really left everything out there, danced our faces off, and got some good looks. Remember when we thought we could teach Marguerite how to ski? <laughs> well, at least meeting the buttermilk patrollers was fun for me. As spring rolled around, there was that rickshaw incident. It was a bad call wearing those granny panties of a tannish tint. <laughs> On to summer 2010, when you really fell in love with this town. With your passion for field hockey and hiking, I knew I'd like having you around. We frequent the Double Dog, the Cantina, the brewery, but only after a hike. The mountain lifestyle was pretty easy to like. As summer went wound down, we saw the hot air balloons at sunrise and watched those rugby boys. Man, I like those big thighs. Off-season travels and the start of winter 2011, Copper Boys, SNL reruns, and the Highlands Bowl was being the stairway to heaven. Skiing buttermilk under the full moons, but my favorite was drinking Tecates in Georgia's secret cabin, cabin listening to CSNY tunes. Summer 2011, here we come. Thursday night concerts, I know Pam had fun. Oh, the beauty, the lakes of hanging Lost Man Cathedral Crater and our favorite, American. Or how about making Meg jump in the Devil's Punch Bowl for a very quick swim? Hey, John, drive Karen and I to that old crystal mill. Let's meet some locals in, Mar in the Marble Ghost Town, buy some books and get a chill. Backpacking to Conundrum Hot Springs for some whiskey and a soak. You were my tent buddy and always down for a toke. <laughs> hey, it's fall. Marguerite and Kara, let's hit the road. Off to the Tetons Park City in Vegas with our camping load. I want to thank you all for the food that you gave us, but don't hold a can of mama's fried potatoes. <laughs> Are you too hot? Too hot for the geyser? Kara, don't forget to pack that green plastic tourist visor. Winter 2012, it was about time that we really took advantage of Cloud Nine. Dancing on tables in champagne to spray, taking off shirts, it got a little cray. Curling? Sure, why not? Here come the meat sweats and those blue pants. Boy, we were hot. Summer 2012, let's go and play in some sand. Road trip into the sand dunes, sure was grand. John packed the duck butter, Mike the beet, the sauce of BBQ. Jesse sang Billy. We even stopped at a gator farm, too. Winter 2013, let's go explore more. On to Telluride, Jack made that trip, not a bore. Traveling with boys sure is smelly, but we always have a ball. We even got some alone time and hiked to a waterfall. The skiing was good, even better the opres. By this point, Kara really knew living in Colorado was not a phase. The winter, we even earned a trophy for drinking. Oh wait, I mean curling. Oh no, maybe it was drinking. No, 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 it was curling. The meat sweats won the championship, even when BT gave the curling Nazis a little lip. Summer 2013, let's hike to the Markley Hut. I hear there's a naked bagpiper up there with really nice buns to strut. Lake Powell, you say? Oh, Captain Mike, rent that boat. Oh, wait, government shutdown. Now there's nowhere to float. Let's get a beer at the grouper and make a plan B. How about... Taos, New Mexico, and rent a house for a small fee. Massage room, hot tub, ger German beers. This place is neato. Highlights include Hot Springs, Naked John, and Ryland's American Flag Speedo. <laughs> In winter 2014, we became ants with Ollie Bear. He's so damn cute, it's not even fair. Birthday bowling, cleaning the grill at Little Annie's, and the last season of the meat sweat, 
Pine Creek Cookhouse with family and friends was a memory not to forget. Summer 2014, engaging and raging, BG pulls the trigger. Then Pete, then Mike, then Andy. Our family just got bigger. Winter 2015 brought everyone together for one more Christmas. Cookie, shanking, and the Farrell's Irish dancing was really a plus. Now here we are, about four months until you say I do. We all know Mike is the perfect man for you. The journey continues, a new chapter in your book. Time for a new adventure, time for a new look. Cheers to you, Kara, this day is for you. When you're back in Aspen, we'll continue to celebrate for a month or two. Always remember, when you want to explore, I'll be here, especially when you want to put on a wig and drink some beer. Congratulations.